Oh, look, a new friend request. Not to humble brag, but some of us get them as much as once a month. On Facebook, it's a totally normal experience, but IRL, what a weird concept. Well, that's not how historical friend squads were assembled. Jesus and all his disciple bros, the three musketeers, the non-Miranda members of Sex in the City, all of them famous friend squads all formed with grace and smoothness. I certainly don't have either of those things, but let's be honest, neither does Miranda. Is it possible for me to infiltrate a group of friends and become part of the squad? To better acquaint myself with the inner workings of squad life, I talked to some of the most successful squad members I know, in addition to a random squad I found on the street. What friendship qualities are essential to be in a squad? Part of being a squad is supporting each other. Mm -hmm. Here we all watch these other back and watch these other toes and watch these other fingernails. That's the squad. So who are each of you in a squad? I'm the weird silly one, probably. Zach is the cute one, I'm the beautiful one, and Eugene was the gorgeous one. The one you want mm -hmm. back? Yeah. I'm the cool guy, you know what I mean? I'm the short guy and the dork guy. And I'm the watcher, they call me Slim. I don't know who I am. Well, I think that having the different qualities of squad members helps balance everybody else out. How many people can be in a squad? Like, how many is too many? There's only too many when y'all dysfunctional. I'd say no more than seven. Seven. What do you guys do when you hang out? Like, what does the squad exactly do? Ooh, what are the activities? Brunch. Camping. Yeah. Kayaking. Do you have any advice for someone just like, say, I don't know, a friend of mine who's trying to get into, get into squad, a squad, what they could mm. do? Gifts oh. is always nice. All you gotta do is throw a football. Just find another person, okay. throw a football with them, oh. and you'll become friends. Okay. What squad do you mm. want to be in? Yeah. Is there an existing squad yeah. that you wish you were a part of? I would love to be in Ladylike. It's Ladylike. It's Ladylike. It's Ladylike. We're playing look -swap. And we're oiling we up here trying our lip tattoos. That's a good squad, but they already have a pretty fleshed out role system there. Yeah. Hey, you know what? Fuck Keith. He's not the least bit ladylike. But me, I'm capable. I could be the missing piece to the beautiful, inspiring, ladylike jigsaw puzzle. Luckily, I could use this video as an excuse to extract all the juicy intel I needed. What kind of qualities as a friend do you have to have to be in a squad? I feel like I'll be friends with anyone who laughs at my jokes, so. <laughs> it was like they were giving me the recipe to the secret sauce, the secret lady sauce. Uh, nope. That sounds bad. How many people is the appropriate number to have in a squad? How many is too many? Seven and up. Seven and up. So seven's the cap. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I'd say no more than seven. <laughs> okay, fine. Keith was right. Unfuck Keith. What's like an activity squads do together? Mm. Eat food. What kind of food? Squawk. Guacamole? Yeah. That's a cool necklace, I just noticed your Thank necklace. You. Clearly I had my work cut out for me. But okay. snacks? Easy. Surely I could okay. find some guacamole at the low stock convenience store half a block away. Do you guys sell guacamole? Oh, I, I, don't, I don't work here. Oh, sorry. They don't have guacamole? Yeah, Are you freaking kidding me? No, that's not it. Where is guacamole sold? You guys don't sell guacamole, right? No but the store didn't have any. But if you mix all of the things we got together, it's basically guacamole. We got lime and chips, salsa verde chips, bean dip, nacho cheese dip, green onion dip, and is this cat food? With my shoddy snacks locked and loaded, it was time to focus on me. What could I personally offer Lady Like? I must have some redeeming qualities. I mean, I was part of a squad during my wild youth in Florida. Hi! Hi, friend! Maybe a former squad member could shed some light on the matter. Okay, so we're doing a video about squads, and there's okay. a group of girls here at BuzzFeed called Ladylike. They go drag racing, and they get to try all the new beauty products, and it's something I've always wanted to be a part of. What are the ladybugs, or lady, what are, what's the thing? Ladylike, they're the coolest people here. <laughs> We had a mini squad in high school. Yeah, we were called the rock stars. <laughs> <laughs> what did it consist of? It was me and you, mm -hmm. Sydney, mm -hmm. Polo, Skeet, Skeet, and Nick. Do you remember the story behind why his name was uh, Skeeter? No. He said it's because his, his mom said that he looked like a mosquito. <laughs> Now, as an adult, I don't know what's happened, but I really don't have a lot of close friends anymore, like, especially female friends. It's weird yeah. how it's changed. I, I don't know. I think that also is just a part of growing up. Do you think I have any qualities, or do you remember any qualities about me that would make me perfect for, like, a squad out here? You were pretty makeup savvy. Yeah. And you were, um, you were definitely a bit of, like, a tomboy, like, sports and shit. So you definitely would be, like, 
cool to go like go kart racing or yeah and, you know. yeah you were you were also fa fairly involved in sports too yeah then I got really into pot you're making a really good case for me oh you could be like the adventurous one yeah I think that just describes me as an adult so yeah I think you could I think you could fit that thanks Darla was right. I am squad worthy. When I'm not barricaded in my apartment like a homely shut-in, I'm absolutely makeup savvy and adventurous. With a renewed sense of confidence, I figured it was time to test the waters and work my makeup savvy magic on Ladylike. We actually set up a hidden camera at their desk. We told them it was for another video for a time lapse. So they have no idea that we are doing this. Um, I'm gonna go try and use my in with Carly as a tactic to go in and maybe like start planting the seeds with them. Be cool. Is my mic showing? No. Cool. Hello. How are you, my friend? Good. How are you? Good. Oh yeah, we're doing that thing you. this week. What are we? Oh yeah, yeah. The, so the so newsletter, yeah. yeah. Oh my gosh, I was I meant to come back up here and tell you guys, Freddie. Have you guys ever seen Rite Aid's makeup section? Yeah, but Candy raved about it one day. Dude, I just went over there and it's like they have their own like goddamn line of makeup. <laughs> it was crazy. I was like, <laughs> it's, like it's, it's nice makeup. Yeah. <laughs> We still need to eat together soon. Yeah. So I have no fucking clue how that went. Clearly, there was no more time for half measures. If I truly wanted in on this squad, I'd have to go all out. Supporting each other. Zach is the cute one. Kayaking. Brunch. No more than seven. Gifts is always nice. Throw a football. So it's time to take all the things I'd learned, the football, the snacks, my adventurous can-do attitude, and put all of it out there for them. Luckily, they happened to be filming a ladylike video that week. It was my time to show them what life could be like with a little slice of Kelsey. Okay, so I know what they like, I know what they don't like, I just, I need to like spruce myself up a little bit to match them. I mean, like, you think I, I could be in it, right? Yeah, we'll see. I'm gonna be in ladylike by the end of the day. Crash the lady like shoot, see if they'll let me be in their squad. Uh, they're doing the Spanx Olympics in there, so I've got my Spanx on, power oh, football, I've got my snacks. I don't see how they could say no. Hey, sorry, sorry I'm late. Hey guys. Hey, what's? Oh, good catch. Thanks. Um, cool. what are you doing? I was thinking about like all the stuff we talked about yesterday about like the squads. And so I just, I thought I could like be in this. Like, <laughs> I just, you know, I feel like you need a wild child in your squad. And so I just figured that I, I could be, I have guacamole you, stuff. Well, it's not guacamole exactly, but. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, they're a little tight, but hey, Freddie. Hey, girl. I, hey. I feel like I would fit in really well in Ladylike. That is very sweet. Right? Yeah. The ladies accepted me with open arms, but in my heart of hearts, I felt I hadn't earned it. Setting up hidden cameras is no way to make friends. If I wanted an authentic squad experience, I'd have to do it right. And so, I did what I always do. Stood around awkwardly with my pants off, and then ran away. I'll text you guys. Are you leaving? Yeah, 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 yeah. I just... They literally couldn't have been like nicer about it, you know what I mean? I'm gonna go take these spanks off now. So maybe warming your way into a squad isn't the best way to go about it. Just like a Facebook friend request, you can't force someone to accept you. It just has to happen organically. Hey, are you guys just sitting around eating cheesy snacks? Yeah. yeah. Can I sit with you? Yeah. yeah. Cool. I'm Kelsey, by the way. Squads come and go. And even if you're between squads at the moment like me, embrace yourself. Learn to love your independence. After all, it's better to be squadless than be a Miranda. Oof. Gosh, she was the worst, huh? Although, I mean, she really did have her shit together more than any other one. I mean, Carrie was just jumping around. She had no idea who she was. Sam was just, you know, I guess we can't say anything about Sam and her sexuality because we need to be sexually liberated, but...